Good morning. It's day four of a week only eating food which has got the finest ingredients cooked in the finest way with the finest nutrition, I suppose. But uh, it, it, it is what it is. I'm not noticing anything particularly marvellous with this week. But nevertheless, it is time for breakfast, so let us beckon into the kitchen. That's not how language works. Yeah, still running out of things to have for breakfast, so... Good old loaf this morning, specifically a Tesco Finest Oat and Barley Farmhouse. Uh, £1.10 for this. It looks a bit um, more, more up my alley than the last seeded loaf. Um, so I'm going to look forward to this. I'm going to shove it in the old toaster, exhibit A, and, uh, and make toast, funnily enough, because that's, uh, that's generally how that works. So how does a piece of toast measure up against a piece of common old as muck toast? It's just toast. As if I expected anything different. It is nice. That butter is very good. And the bread's right. Yeah, definitely prefer to the, um, the cedar loaf. But like I was just a chicken eating seeds with that rasp bread. Hmm. Just gonna eat this whole thing on camera now. Some people complain that I'm not on camera eating the stuff enough. It is a cold one this morning, and if I had tits, they would be freezing off right now. As in, I'd be freezing my tits off because, as I mentioned, it is cold. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, where is it? I'm gonna warm myself up with Tesco Finest Green Tea with Jasmine. It's healthy as shit, green tea. I'm gonna be healthy. No, I'm definitely not gonna be healthy today. So um, yes, I'm going to make myself a nice warming green tea, flush out my toxins. You see, I have plenty of toxins that need flushing out, if you know what I mean. I'm a murderer. You see. So I'm going to make a nice cup of tea and then um, I'm going to crack on with work. It's very cold, did I say that? Look at this! How fancy is this? It's like it's made out of my mum's neck curtains. Amazing. So how am I going to make my green tea with jasmine fancier? Let's put it in this uh, it's a nice big Canadian cup. So uh, yes, I'm going to fill this out. Make a nice Canadian jasmine tea. Nom, nom, nom. So the instructions on the teas that I had to allow it to infuse for three minutes, so that's what I've done. Smells very green tea with um, with a little bit of jasmine in there. I used to absolutely love jasmine tea. I used to go out to a local, um, local Chinese restaurant and uh, had a little pot of jasmine tea. And you, I can't seem to find it as, as, as easily anymore. I'm sure they do do... Uh, jasmine tea around but I can't find it unless it seems to you get like the loose leaves and ain't, ain't nobody got time for that or it's infused with some uh, some green tea so I mean I'll take what I can get mm. oh that is nice that is very very nice mm. cheers presented without comment <laughs> Not really. Please check out my book. Link's in the description. Unlike the last two days where I've had croissants, the toast hasn't really kept me full today. So it has gone from here, and it is now making its way down my digestion. and... I, I seriously don't know what's going on with the accents. I, I need to go back... Where's my molecule, you see? I need to... I need to go back to being Sir Williamson Snoots from Essex Shire and my sister is the Countess of the Moon and I'm currently hungry so I, 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 I'm I going to I'm going to partake in some luncheon you see so and, and, and the thing that is interesting about today's is it's another ready meal but this one is microwavable because <sighs> the packaging is, is metallic you see so I'm going to Hop on this mac and cheese party train, and I'm going to enjoy some cheesy, oozy, wheezy, goo gooey goodness, you see. I fucking, what am I talking about? Oh my word. Tesco Finest Mac and Tr 
triple cheese. It's important to, to say the triple part. So it's cooked in a rich cheddar sauce, finished with tortilla chips and red Leicester. I don't, I don't know where the, the third cheese comes in. It doesn't say, but, <laughs> or does it? Maybe says, maybe somewhere on the back. So we have red Leicester, um, medium fat, soft cheese. Okay, whatever, there's the third cheese. And um, it smells amazing. It would probably have been crunchy had I put it in the actual oven, but, um, but, but you know, I want it now, so. Mm. Oh, wow, yeah. The, um, the crisp, or not crisp as it is, topping, really gives it that edge. That's really nice. Mm. It's ooey and gooey. I wish I had some kind of bread to mop that up because I'm going to be left with a lot of cheesy sauce at the end. And also, I really don't like how this is such a big thing. This is massive, which means the actual layer of food is very, very small. It's like a centimetre of food. Just make the packaging smaller and double up on this and, you know, that's really nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Today has gone well. Today's going very well, darling, yeah. I might, I might even not have sex with my sister tonight because I'm very happy that I've had my mac and cheese, my mac and triple cheese. No, don't forget that triple. No. So. That was, uh, that was some good stuff. I do like a mac and cheese, and Tesco finest mac and cheese is HQ mac and cheese. So I'm, I'm very happy. Had a very happy afternoon being full of cheese and mac. So um, it is it is getting on though. So I should do some work. I shouldn't I shouldn't be here vlogging. Although it is uh, technically his work is get the book the book. I'm, okay, I'm gonna go get some dinner. Do you know what I fancy tonight? A bit of Diane. Do you want some Diane, Grace? Okay. Bit of Diane, slow cooked Diane, steak Diane. Yes, very funny. Six pounds for this. It looks a little bit like puke, but. Um, it's nice, it's a nice thing, steak dining, nice saucy sauce. Slow cooked beef in a classic cream mushroom aged brandy and white wine sauce. Superb, so with our steak Diane, oh that was six pounds, with our steak Diane, some more triple cooked chips. These weren't as nice as the, the, the frozen ones, but um, they're gonna go out of date if I don't eat them. Uh, they were what, 260? Then uh, some bit of veg. Amazingly, they have some fresh vegetables. Uh, one pound sixty-five. I think one pound thirty-five. These were extra fine. Now extra fine. These beans extra fine. So yes, all in the oven. Well, put on those. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to this one. Well, here it is, and it smells bloody good. Um, put the chips in for a little bit longer this time, um, purely to try and get a bit more crisp on there. And as you can see, oh yes, that's worked. So I'm going to try some mushroomy Diane sauce. Grace has decided to um, to jump ahead because she's starving. What do you reckon, babe? Yeah, really nice. Really creamy and mushroomy. Creamy and mushroomy. It is, actually. Wow. Let's try some of this. Oh, that beef. That cut like butter. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that beef is so tender. Wow, that is, mmm, best thing so far. Mmm. Worth the six. Mmm, mmm. Worth it for making sex noises. Now I'm gonna shut this off. And I'm gonna bloody enjoy this. Right. It's pretty late. I'm doing um, a uni assignment currently, working on a script. I don't know if I've already mentioned that this week or not. Um, and I had a couple of more of those. Those biscuits, those Tesco finest quadruple chocolate biscuits or cookies as they are, are uh, called on the packaging. And they are still really good and dinner was so good. I could eat that steak Diane with anything. You don't have to have it with chips and green beans, it would go with anything. Perhaps not anything else saucy, but anything. It would go with croissants. It would go with those horrible chocolate Prosecco pots I had. Anything. Oh, I could have them again, honestly. 
a whole one, maybe if you just whizzed it up into like a soup, oh my god, that would be so good. So, that's been, yeah, as you can tell, good, good end to the day, basically. Breakfast was toast, which, um, yeah, toast, can't go wrong really, that butter, still very, very tasty. Mac and cheese, would have preferred it in the oven, but it was bloody nice. Uh, I've got to admit. And then dinner, yes, I couldn't, I can't sing that enough. That is by far the nicest thing I've had this week. I would have it again, always and forever, and be very happy. So I am going to go and finish this script. Um, it's it's not going to write itself, I suppose. My degree is not going to get itself. Um, so thank you very, very much for watching, darlings. Um, I very much appreciate it. If you want to support the channel, you can do by supporting it on Patreon. You get to the videos early, you get your name in the credits bunch of other cool stuff. Um, my novel is now available. Um, all the links are in the description. Or you can just simply like the video, subscribe, share it, follow me on social media and all that stuff. So thank you very much and I'll see you for the fifth day. For tomorrow, the fifth day, darling. Oh.